I'm gonna try to um add an air pump to this that can shoot out. This is the model. Very simple. Soon we're gonna have to add it somewhere onto here. It'll be very difficult. I'm not sure we get to this. And here are the bullets. These are still in testing. This one almost works. While this one barely does at all, which is useless. I'm still trying to find new ways. For example, by switching this out with this and then using this portion and to fire an eraser. This could also s save me uh, more time. But we, I don't really know for, for certain. The nine, this is wired by a 9 volt battery. And we're going to do some tests. There is, in fact, no on and off switch. It's just really, um, this. As you can see, hold it down. It fires. It holds the air in here and everywhere else and it fires. So if this can work. Here. And look at this could work. Another thing is, if I update it, like hit it or something, it will have to just fire out randomly. But I want to do it without that. Waiting, 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 waiting. Then, fire. Let me try this one. And then, this one. I think th I think this one's a tiny bit more better though. It does have some air gaps. Never mind. Uh, this. Either. But you get the idea. It's supposed to fire out. Automatically. I'm still having a tiny bit issues with it. Because if you put on this one, we're gonna wait a certain time before we actually have to hit it to fire it. I don't want to hit it too far because it's going to want to be on the um, car. And if it is on the car, I need to add, add another servo to it. I do not want to add another servo. This is going to have like four servos already, and I don't think I have enough for that even. So, take this out. Let me just pause down. Try to add this. There we go. We then put this eraser in. This is from a um, mechanical pencil. This should work. See? This is definitely better though. The problem is though, I don't think I have enough of these erasers. Well, because I don't, I don't actually have mechanical pencils at hand. You know, summer and stuff. That well, after some time searching, I found it. This method is definitely good, but I don't have enough resources resor for it, so I the resources for the ammunition is very low. It's proven to be good, and it's lost. But, oh, wait, never mind, I found it. So, what do I do? We either one find, get more of these erasers, two make better bullets, or three just find another way to fire something. But for now, we're going with the um second op a second option I think. Get more ammunition and not more ammunition, but better ammunition. So it's this thing I can update it. Update. Even though I guess here is fine.
but it's like unlike the other one, it builds up pressure and actually tries to slide out. But this one, it barely doesn't even move it. So you know, update. So let's build one, shall we? So to make it, what I usually do is have a straw, some glue, and my 3D pen. Let's see how that works. That's actually really it. Just do this. Another thing we should also do is put some glue around it. But for now, let's test this, and then we'll put some glue around it. So I have it connected to here. And one thing I noticed with this one, it goes more easily in. But this one, a tiny bit harder. So it's probably most likely going to be something like this. Unless I cut, of course. Let's test it. Just what I thought. Air coming from this direction right here. Probably not, or, probably, that's probably why it doesn't fire as well. This one from here. And this is why you must glue everything. I'll be back when I'm at once and we're back. So, after this thing, this thing was dried, we're gonna test it. It is now connected, so now I'm gonna connect the battery. Work and just do this. Go. This is a long time. Another thing which I did was I found out I could just melt the top of this thing so it's completely shut. So let's have this one now. Now that's a test. That's something good. Just put it on the right angle. Like that. Another thing is, I also found this, which has this on it, which is much more easy to put on. Other than that, I've also been trying to find more ways to use this. Like, for example, I made this, which fixes on top, and let me just turn it off, this is annoying, which fixes on top really nicely, but I don't think it works as good. Still is my setup to hold, to hold my phone in place. So I think we're gonna stick with this, melting on the top and using the straws. It should be much more easier. Though one part of it is that sometimes when we want to put the straw straw on, it's hard to put it on. It's not go easily in, but others it goes straight in. So we might need to find a way to pick a good amount of straw, whatever that means. Go. This was off. We could do this. This like this. Like this, I guess. Like this, I guess. See. 
Okay. So let me try and make a good bullet bullet for this. Go and get started. Okay, so I got a straw right here. See if it actually goes to the tube nicely. Yeah, it goes to the tube nicely. Okay, we can use this one. So, cut a good piece up, good piece up off of this. <clears throat> you wait until this thing's ready. Then we use this to melt it. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Waiting, 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 done. You squeeze these things together like so. Um, bit bit deep, boppity, don't burn my hands off, please. Boo. And as it dries, we should be good to go. Done. Simple, simple work. Okay, so I'm gonna put this on. There we go. Put this on. Just too close. Still not working. Still not working. Let me see. It could be another problem. Nope. Everything's fine. Oh, there's an air gap. And I got right here. If you could hear that. Right. Wait. It's right here. Camera, zoom in. Okay, it's camera. I will take care of it, right? Okay, um, I'm going to fix it real quickly. Okay, this time I've actually fixed it. It should be better. Okay. Okay, if I turn off, get this again, put it right here, it should fire, fire good. Oh, hopefully. Okay, let me do that again. Right here. I should really have a switch for this. We do one.
Hopefully you saw that. Let me do that again. Let me just find it. Try again, this time in the best position as possible. Put it right here. Here. That should do it. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, let's do this again. Up. And there we go. Out my eye. Well, that's why I wear safety glasses, kids. It hit my eye. But at least it works. Ah. Connected it to my, um, Arduino. So it should be on. Let me just connect. Something's wrong. Oh, obviously this wire's broken. Okay, wait. Okay, I fixed it. Let's just do this. Connect that. That. Not one. Do that. Do that. Do that. Should be good. Okay. Now. Okay, what now? I want one. Does not even reach it. And uh, now I fixed it finally. Of course, don't. No, I was just uh, it right now. Now it's activated by this control. Let's do a couple more things. Okay, everything is now finally fixed. Hopefully. You can see I got a target. There's um That's better. Okay then. Yeah, okay. That's pointing down. Of course when I test it it doesn't work. Let me just um Go. Now. What purpose do you have if you don't have to work? Let me just uh, put it up there again. Make sure actually facing the right direction. Now, when it works, it faces downwards. Function, function, I tell you. Well, it works. Soon I'm gonna add the car. Instead of using this um, short way to power up, most likely to use this. It has the same dynamic and everything else. I'll see you later next time.